Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I install these crochet braids that I got from Toyatress on Amazon using the braidless crochet method. So if you are interested while well, keep on watching, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a big thumbs up and to comment down in the comment section bar down below. So the braids that I'm going to be using today is from Toya Tress. This is their Ocean Wave braids. I got it in the color 1B and one pack of this hair can do your entire head. It came with eight smaller packs of braids inside of the big package and on each of the loop there is 18 crocheted Ocean Wave inside of each of the smaller packs. So onto the styling part of this video, today I'm going to be doing the braidless crochet method. So firstly, I'm just going to clear out my natural hair and then I'm going in to part my hair to the left side to create the braidless crochet method. So now I'm going in with my water and conditioner to moisten my hair a bit and then I'm going in with my holy grail, my gorilla snot gel to further lay my natural hair. So after I finish doing that, I'm going in with my got to be blast free spray to set everything in place so after I'm satisfied with how everything is laid I'm going to tie down my hair so that the hair could be laid a little bit more I'm going in with my blow dryer to blow dry everything before I go to crochet the braids onto my head so now I am just going to twist my hair into two in the back and I'm going in with my weaving net so that I can crochet my braids. So as you can see, all I'm doing is I am doing the looping method to the back. I'm looping the braids twice. So I'm just gonna work my way up until I get to the front portion of my hair. So when I get to the middle portion of my hair, I'm just splitting the crochet braids into two to create that fuller effect to the middle without using a lot of the crochet braids. So far, I've used four packs of the crochet braids so far. So what I'm doing is I'm pushing the crochet needle through the net and my hair. So I'm just going to work on that until I'm satisfied. So I'm just looping the hair around thrice. So as you can see, when I am finished doing the looping method, when I get to the parting space area, I'm just going to cut off the stocking cap around my air area. So after I finish cutting off the excess stocking cap, I'm going ahead to start the knotless crochet method. So I'm just going to pull through the hair with the crochet pin and instead of looping both ends, I'm just going to be looping one end of the crochet braids and I'm just going to wrap that around two times and I'm going to continue this process until the entire section is filled with the ocean wave crochet braids. So again, I'm pulling through one side of the ocean wave hair and I'm just going to continue that process until I am satisfied with how I want the parting space to look. So I'm just going ahead to fill up the parting space until I am satisfied using the knotless crochet method to the top. So this is the end result of my braidless crochet method. I hope you enjoyed it. So until next time, see you in my next video and God bless. Yeah, I need you stay with me, I'ma show you good love